many of you speak in tongues and you're proud of it? Just lift up your hand. Wave your hands at me. Okay. Do you know you are already experiencing the rest of faith as an example? Speaking in tongues is an example of rest. I mean, this is what the Bible says. Isaiah 28 verse 11. For with stammering lips in another tongue, he will speak to this people. To whom he said, this is the rest with which you may cause the weary to rest. And this is the refreshing. So the Bible says this. When you speak in tongues, you are entering into God's rest. You are getting yourself refreshed. Isn't it true? How do you speak in tongues? Your mind is not giving you the words to speak. It's out of your spirit you're speaking. Your mind is totally at rest. Your mind is not stressed. If I get you to come out and say, all right, come here and lead a prayer. Everybody will, what am I going to say? What am I going to say? What am I going to say? Oh, Father, Lord God, Father, Lord God, Lord God, Father, Father, Lord God, Father, bless, Father, Lord God, bless, Father, Lord God. How many of you have people stressed? I've seen people giving thanks. Can you please give thanks for food? <gasps> give thanks for food in front of all the pastors. Oh, Father, Lord God, Father, Lord God, bless, 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 bless the food, 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 Father, Lord God. But I say, can you speak in tongues? Easy. No stress. No stress. And you're praying. And you know what? When you speak in tongues, your prayer is powerful because you're praying according to the will of the Holy Spirit. The devil is afraid of it. The power of God is being released. Hey, I can pray powerful prayer that cause devils to flee with no stress. This is rest. This is an example of how God wants to live our everyday life. Whether is it making money to make ends meet in our job, in our career, getting a healthier body, getting healing, having a happy marriage, a family life, having a breakthrough in our ministry, growing our cell group, growing our services, preaching the word, getting people saved. God wants us to enter into the rest of faith where we lean on His power, we lean on His anointing to get a job done for His glory. Go ahead and give God a big hand. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.